Hey guys, y'all know what time it is. It's time for empties. Oh, I even have this upside down. Hi beauties and girls, welcome back for another video. And in today's video, we are doing empties. Yes, we are on the road to completing 300 empties in this calendar year. We did like 250. Actually, we did a little bit more than 250 last year. But I'll just let you guys know, give you a little hint that I am going to be doing like a one year, like no buy. I need to save some for some other things. So in terms of beauty products, except with an exception of like, I got some rules for myself, but in today's video, we are going to get through these empties. I am gonna separate my makeup empties into a different empties video, just because I have so much y'all and I will be here forever. Forever, ever, forever, ever, ever. Okay, so let's start off with the dove dry oil moisture love this body wash amazing i went through two of these hello went through two of these i would repurchase i'm gonna repurchase okay finally went through this shea moisture monongo simp hemp seed oil high porosity moisture seal shampoo i really like this it has apple center apple cider vinegar and boabat protein this is one of the shea moisture products that my hair actually likes and also the jamaican black castor oil shampoo those are probably pretty much the only shampoos that i have tried that i love from um from shea moisture and i would repurchase this i really like it by the way i do have a full review of that yes if i have reviews on any of this stuff i'll let you know i included food in this you guys let me just go ahead and tell y'all I'll wait. I'll hold on. Okay, another body wash. This is from Olay. This is the Orchid and Black Current. It was okay. I feel like, you know, I, or, Olay doesn't give me a, um, a lather like Dove does, but this was on sale. I couldn't resist. And it did last a long time. 30 fluid ounces. Would I repurchase it if it's on sale? But I am not a fan of Olay versus Dove. I am a Dove girl, okay? I tried this. This is the Summer's Eve Coconut Water Cleansing Wash. It's supposed to be a simpler feminine wash, more simple, more natural. It was okay, okay? Um, there are some brands, the the Le J Cleansing Wash from Sorenzo. Love that better. And it has like goat's milk or something like it. It, it has some good cultures. And that one just does the right thing. But this, I wouldn't repurchase. I like the Summer's Eve aloe over this that's exclusive to Target, but no, I'm not repurchasing that. This is the three-on-one formula remove from Zoya. Love this. And I would repurchase it. I actually have a backup and I got a little bit. Oh, I got a little bit in there. Let me get that out, but we're going to consider that an empty. And this is a really good, like, you just put your pad on the top. It's really good. This is the VO5 Extra Body Shampoo with collagen, volumizing. My husband used this. When these don't work for well for me, I tend to use it as a body wash. That's what I do a lot of times. Didn't like it, but my husband did. He's the one who uses this, so I'm not repurchasing it, but he might but it's an empty. L'Occitane Milk, Milk Concentrate, love this. I'm working on the scrub, but I love this. Do y'all see? It's gone, it smells so good. This is the best scent of almond I have ever smelled in my life. This is so good, and yes, I would purchase that because that I got in PR, but y'all, it's worth it. I've gotten some stuff from L'Occitane before, so y'all know, I don't discriminate. Okay, this is the pre-cleanse by Dermalogica. Really like this, but I I don't know. I'm kind of like over this at the moment. Just because I like things, I like dual cleansers, okay? Things that can clean my face and remove the makeup. I'm, I, I think I'm in that place. And this is very oily. Let me stop doing that because it's flinging oil everywhere. But as I like it, but as of right now, I'm not gonna repurchase it, but I like it a lot. You know, sometimes you just get tired of things. I think that's where I am with this product, but I really like it. This is the Dove Dry Spray. It helps restore natural tone under your armpits. And I'm trying to do some natural deodorants. So for right now, I'm not gonna purchase any Dove. Not for me, no. 
So, not, and not in terms of like deodorant. I'm gonna try. I have like this one from La Vanilla. This is the Sport Lux. It kept me dry pretty much all day. So, yeah, not gonna repurchase that right now. Um, I have my vitamins. These are the prenatal. I'm still taking a prenatal, y'all. Okay, I'm not pregnant, but I do try these, and these are good. I use these even before and after. It's just like a double dose, you know what I'm saying? So, like that one. This is the B12 Energy. This is okay. I didn't feel like these made really a difference, or maybe I'm just hyper all the time. This is the X Factor Kids. This is a Plexus. Uh, chewable tablets. It was, they remind me of Flintstone kids. Yes, I did take a few, so don't judge me, but those were good. This is the coconut style setter, coconut water style setter by Camille Rose. I love this. I'm picking this up again. It is so good. It is so good and it's so gone, but I will repurchase that. A lotion, stress relief. This is the eucalyptus tea by Bath and Body Works. Love it. I have the lavender vanilla one over there and I loved it a lot. Would I repurchase it? I have the lavender vanilla, but this one is good. This one is a nice, like relaxing massage type of lotion. So if you're looking for something that's like soothing, that has like this spa scent, then this is something that you would want to get. Anivia, y'all know it's good. Anivia and a body wash is gonna always be in here. A Dove body wash, I think. Or what's the other one? Caress, love this. I have like, I think another bottle of this. This is something that I will try to have in backups because my sons, everybody, this is like the family lotion. Have a family lotion, y'all, that everybody can use. You know, you can just slather all over your body when it's time. Sorry, you guys, I got a phone call, so I had to take it. If the angle is different, that's the reason why. But let's get back into these. I talked about the Bev Nouveau already, and I have not tried stuff from this brand in a while. So I'm curious, I would repurchase this. I don't know if I would repurchase this because I like for my deep conditions to give me slip, but it definitely deep conditioned my hair. But um, I'll probably pass on this one. This is vegan and protein free. So if you are protein sensitive, this might be something that you wanna try though. Okay, so let's talk about the Dr. Keels. Dr. Keels. This is the Dr. Teal's Pink Himalayan Foaming Bath. This is the Restore and Replenish. I don't tend to take baths. But when I go out of town, I will. I take Lysol with me. I clean out the tub and I will get in that joker. And uh, I actually take baths. So this is the size that I would take. I don't even remember how I got this. I want to say this was like from a value bag or some type of beauty bag from CVS or whatever. But this is definitely the size that I would get. I don't think I would invest in the large one. And this is great to soak your feet if you're doing manicures and pedicures. So really like that. I would repurchase the size. Glass empty, y'all. I've gone, I've eaten this soup from Trader Joe's like three, maybe two or three times and love it. It is their Trader Joe Ming, Trader Ming's, not Trader Joe's, Trader Ming's. This is their chicken and vegetable wonton soup. This is so good. It is so good. I showed y'all this on my YouTube community tab. And y'all was like, oh, girl, that looks so good. With some sriracha. Just put it up with sriracha. <laughs> oh, muy caliente. Although this is like, oh, this is so good. And you put it in for like four minutes into the microwave. So good. These are like chicken dumplings. O-M-G. So good. And y'all know, it's, it's one of those like rainy day soups. If you don't have pho where you are, Trader Mings. If you guys want to see more like food, more like things like that, that's empty, let me know. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.